Hello children, welcome back to the new video. So today we are going to make a parachute. To make that we need a polythene bag, scissor, uh, cello tape, woolen thread and marker. So let's start. So now we have to cut this part of my polythene bag with the help of a scissor like this. Once you are done cutting that part, open this folded part like this from both the sides. Now after opening that part, you have to cut one side of this polythene bag by using. Now we have to take one end of this polythene bag, fold it like this. out like this to make a square shape. Now you can see that we have a square shape. Now let's start the folding part. First you have to take this one end, fold it, make this one fold in this way. Again we have to repeat the same process. Take the another end, fold. Just be careful with the numbers of folds. Again Take this end, fold. So this was my third fold. And now, take this end and fold it like this. You are done with this. Now, once you are done with this, Take the scissor and cut out the extra part like this. Now try to make an arc shape. Like this. Now let's open. We are going to place it here and with the help of the cello tape we are going to fix it for all the sides. So let's do it. Now you can see that I have placed all my threads by using the cello tape. Now you have to pick it like this. Just make sure that the ends of the threads are equal. If they are not equal, try to make them equal by cutting the extra part. understand the concept behind this activity. Now on parachute there are two forces that acts. The first is the gravitational force and second is the air force. As both of these forces works against each other, it lower down the motion of the parachute and thus it makes it to land safely. I can see that I have tied my object with the thread. Now let's test. This.